I was born on November 24, 1784, in Barbersville, Virginia. My name is Zachary Taylor, and my story is one of military valor, presidential leadership, and the challenges of a divided nation. From a young age, I had a strong desire to serve my country. I pursued a military career and joined the United States Army at the age of 24. Throughout my military service, I earned a reputation as a skilled tactician and leader, particularly during the Mexican-American War. During the Mexican-American War, I commanded American forces in several significant battles, including the Battle of Buena Vista. My strategic decisions and valor on the battlefield led to notable victories and earned me the nickname Old Rough and Ready. My military career spanned over four decades, and I rose through the ranks to become a major general. I developed a deep sense of loyalty and duty towards my soldiers, and I emphasized discipline and training in order to maintain a strong and effective fighting force. In 1848, following the end of the war, I retired from the military and transitioned into politics. My military reputation and popularity propelled me to the presidency, and I was elected as the 12th President of the United States in 1848. As president, I faced numerous challenges— most notably the issue of slavery. The country was deeply divided on this issue, with tensions between the North and South steadily increasing. I sought to maintain a delicate balance between the interests of the free states and the slave states, advocating for a peaceful resolution to the growing conflict. I also prioritized the preservation of the Union and the enforcement of the laws of the land. I firmly believed in the supremacy of the federal government and worked to uphold the principles laid out in the Constitution. Unfortunately, my presidency was cut short. On July 4, 1850, while still in office, I attended a ceremony in extreme heat, and shortly after, I fell ill with what is believed to have been gastroenteritis or cholera. I passed away on July 9, 1850, just 16 months into my presidency. While my presidency was brief, I hope to be remembered as a leader who upheld the values of duty, honor, and dedication to the well-being of my country. My military background shaped my leadership style, and I brought that same sense of discipline and determination to the presidency. As I reflect on my life, I am proud of my military achievements, my commitment to preserving the Union.